Hi there, Internet. Hi, look at this. I'm a uh, big. Ooh, I'm big. I'm big. I'm the creepy Internet guy with the creepy Internet thing on my face. And I just wanted to say hello. Thanks for watching my Let's Play videos. They are um, pretty much the fucking most cheapest, budgetest bullshit around. I mean, you can hear me breathe in the fucking fan. I don't give a fuck. I, I zero. It's, that's about that. I did. I'm um, today. We're in Argolis, Greece, in the 1960s dirt rally in the Oculus Rift. I'm really making this video to show my friends and neighbors and the, the children uh, how cool and fun the Oculus Rift is. And what I'll do is I will probably screw up this race really bad. We'll see. Uh, but I will have fun doing it. Uh, so here we go. I am getting a little bit better. I did the last, the tutorial event, I guess, and I got fifth, which um, is a huge improvement. And it like opened up the rest of the game. So now we're in Argolis, Greece, in the 1960s, and I am not able to push my mouse button. I gotta. I'm gonna cheat real quick. Okay, there we go. And now it's gonna start. Okay. And it's important when you're in the rift to reset your view every time. Look, there's a drone. I didn't think there were drones. Three, in the two, okay, let's one, do this. Uh, I named my co-pilot here Bob. Right, three continues he for talks 100. a lot. More than me. Well, Name maybe not more. Than jump maybe 100. Oh, now this place right, is six, cool. Three, I love them. Driving fast on dirt roads. And I'm crashing. Jump. Oh boy. Ouch. Why did I turn into fucking Mickey Mouse in that crash? Wow, look at how gorgeous the frickin' landscape is, though. Kinda reminds me of home, although these mountains are way bigger than my my hometown mountains. I live in the Appalachian chain of the mountains, and they are quite old mountains. Where the hell are we going? I got way better as soon as I actually put my glasses on. It makes the game look so much cooler. Yeah, we are driving on some serious crappy roadage. This is some backwoods bullshit. Right? And I killed a civilian. Two, two or three civilians. Probably not killed them. I was going really slow because I saw that nasty turn there. And uh, Dirt Rally is a really realistic racing game, which is cool. And I love the feeling that. You know, this is what it would be like to really drive like this. Uh, and I've driven pretty fast on the road, but not like this. Not the little little Toyota Tercel from the 1960s. It's turn one four tight. Alright, we're good. We're good. This is such a freaking and just rally driving in general is a ridiculous amount of freaking turns and jerks and twists and dive. Look at that. That could kill me. That could literally kill me. Um, but I guess that's why rally driving is more exciting than all the other races. Because there's certain twists and turns and if you are not on your A driving game, you literally, like, die. Like, literally die. Hitler shows up and fucking kills you. And there we go. Alright. Open 60. How's everybody? How are you today, Bob? You know, you're just a fucking virtual thing. Holy hell, we're driving like a madman. Roomie! There we go. Oh shit, shit, shit. We're driving. Oh, don't die, don't die. Oh, 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 oh. I slam on the brakes. I thought I was a goner. I thought I was going down that hill. But I made it. Uh, my uh, engineers are going to be super pissed at me, but I made it. Alright. So you just made it to a checkpoint. No clue how much further this race is. The initial map of it freaking insane, it was all through this valley, it's a up and down three. the mountains. Uh, okay, we got that. Into left two hey, wave to the cameras. 
She left six. Holy hell. It's a rush three half long through I wonder, I guess the three D effect and the the actual size it's a left three long. Um, in fact, the actual feeling of being put into this world uh, doesn't translate very well to the video. And it just, you know, looks like me playing any old game with a big fucking black thing with stars on it on my face. Oh shit, there's a big old turn. I can't even... There it is. There's a power around it. Come on. We got it. We got it. Oh, another big hairpin. Let's slide this one. Dig, dig. It's a bright five. Alright. Uh, well, we're going up the mountain. I can get a little speed. There we go. Right four, don't cut. There's this big old turn. Into left three, half long. There we go. Alright. Left four, long, over crest, keep in. And right six, sixty. Oh, got to get control, get control, get control before the rear turn right. Okay, here it comes. Dig into it. Alright, we didn't crash on it. Okay, here we go. Maybe we need a little speed on this hill. And, um... I wonder if there is a way to turn the shifting off. It's funny, I uh, had a couple people come over and I was trying to show them how much fun it is to race. And I mean, they were the freaking fact that I have it set up to manually shift was really throwing them for a loop. You know, they just kept winding out first gear. And then I tell them they had to shift and they get all mad. It's like. You know, if you want to be a race car driver, you need to learn how to drive a stick shift there. Absolutely. Alright, let's get some time going here. Well, that's not going to work. Okay, come on. So let's see, hopefully we got in the top five. How do we do? How do we do, folks? Oh, six minutes. I don't, I don't like that. Ugh, that uh, makes us way the fuck down there, like, it's almost dead last place. Oh well, that's a fun, fun, um, fun level anyhow. And I'll see you next race.